Hey guys, what's going on? So, as you can probably hear it's like really windy outside. You can probably hear it like blowing against the um, garage door and stuff. But I figured I would do an update on Squirt. It's been quite a while for those of you who ha haven't seen um, Squirt before or didn't know about him. Um, he's a male uh, Enigma Leopard Gecko. I've been told he's a Tangerine Enigma, but I'm not sure. I don't really, I don't really follow the Leopard Gecko morphs too much. Um, but figure I'll take him out. He's he's a little bit skittish. He doesn't get held a whole ton, but I mean he's totally he's fine. He won't like bite or anything. Um, he's a pretty big boy. Um, Cameron's actually probably gonna either bring some of his females over or I'll let him take square for a little while. But I mean he's he's pretty uh, reasonably sized. He's definitely breedable. Um, so right now have him in here. You got the water, calcium food dish, this little hide thing that he always is in, um, you can see him in there, um, I had the, uh, we moved the hide though, I used to have it right here, which is why there's like the, um, little velcro thing, it wasn't because this was velcroed on, it was just to kind of protect the glass, um, but I moved it over here, so, I've got multiple hides and stuff, and I just have a bunch of plants in there for no real reason, but, um, here, I'll take them out. Um, I'm going to put them on this kind of like little display area that I did for taking pictures and stuff of animals. Um, so, yeah, I can't see. So, um, I mean, he's, he's definitely not as um, nicely colored as he used to be. He used to be a lot brighter for those of you who. Um, remember seeing him, but then again, he also is under like fluorescent light right now, which gives off like really, really crummy uh, colorations for cameras. Um, and he's not looking his brightest right now either. He usually is more orange. He's kind of more of a yellowish right now. But um, he's a nice little guy. Isn't that right? Yeah. But I don't know if you're staying in the camera or not, so you gotta. But yeah, that's Squirt. Um, not hundred percent sure how old he is now. A couple years old. I'll try and get down to his level to show you guys. There he is. That's Squirt. It's not really in focus. There we go. That's Squirt. Um, male Enigma Leopard Gecko. Um, a nice big fat tail. Um, he could probably actually be bigger too. He just like, and I hate that the camera is not picking it. It's like. The light is just like drowning out his color horribly. Is it what? What'd you just say? I would bust you up. I mean, um, I don't know why he just likes best. Like, oh, he's probably looking at the crickets. <laughs> crickets are right there. That was probably a bad choice of um, placement. Um, he just like just like twitched all of a sudden. I didn't do anything over here, so he sees the crickets. He's a fat little guy. Hey, you know what? What the hell? Well, um, we can go ahead and weigh him real quick. I have the scale right here. Um, like I said, he hasn't eaten in a day or two, so he's not um probably at his biggest he could be. Um, feeding him today, so you know what, maybe I'll actually feed him on camera. Um, but yeah, let me turn the scale on and we can get a weight. And he's definitely breedable, I mean, there's no doubt about that. Alright, let me zoom this guy out so we can... Alright, you guys can see the weight and everything. Right, there we go. Hey buddy, come on, real quick. Alright, try not to like... 71, 72. 
Alright, so, not bad. Breedable by any means. Um, I mean, especially for a male. I mean, it's kind of going between 71 and 72. I've gotten him at, like, almost 80 before, but that's, like, full, so... He's, what, 72 on empty. <laughs> that's pretty... That's a pretty fat little guy. Alright, um... And he doesn't have, like, any giant or anything in him, so, I mean... As you can see, I mean, he is pretty much a normal-sized leopard gecko. Just... Fat one. <laughs> Alright, so I guess, you know, we'll give him maybe a couple crickets or something. Um... Maybe some worms. Kind of see how this goes. Um, we'll find somewhere to feed them though. Alright, so one sec. This is my kind of half assed um, attempt at a feeding container. Just put some paper towel into a 16 quart tub for traction and stuff so you can actually like grab stuff without like slipping all, slip and sliding all over the tub. Um, so I'm going to try a couple crickets and some mealworms, um, maybe a super worm or two. I'm not even going to dust them just because the, I'm not going to feed them like that much, so it shouldn't be that much of a problem. Hopefully he'll actually like eat, you know, it looks like he'll eat. Maybe not. He's kind of weird when it comes to eating on camera. Sometimes he will, sometimes he won't. What the hell did you just grab? Did you grab a leg or like a mouthful of... I'm not sure if he just got a leg or a mouthful of paper towel, so... He's not exactly the smartest, uh... Leopard gecko ever though, so I mean. Where'd that other one go? There you are. Oh, bugger. You should probably grab the cricket. You know you want it. Come on. <laughs> you hear the garage creaking. That is all wind just going right up against the garage. What are you doing, dude? Come on. You have to remember they're nocturnal, so um, trying to feed them during the day doesn't always work. Um, he tends to do that a lot where he'll just go for one if he doesn't get it the first time. He's like, eh, I don't really feel like doing this anyway. Kind of fat and lazy, so. What are you doing? <laughs> Stalking. <laughs> he just licks it. Uh, you fool. Okay. Maybe the paper towel is not working out. Usually. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't want to be held, I know. He doesn't really like being held. I think he's just stressed out by being taken out and being put on the spot for filming and stuff. He's not allowing them. Not allowing him to express his creative freedom, you know. Okay, well, um, that didn't work, so. It's worth a shot, though. He licked one, though, so that's, I think, as good as you're gonna get. Alright, guys. Peace.